Hello YouTubers, this is Average Joe Video and today I'm going to take you along to the local landscape supply yard to pick up two tons of number three river rock using my 2020 Lamar mini dump trailer. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and like this video. It really helps a lot with the YouTube algorithms. Okay, so here we are at the local landscape supply yard. This is not a huge yard, but I will say that they seem to have everything. So it works out very well because it's the closest landscape supply yard to my home. Once again, I have a 2020 Lamar mini dump trailer. It is five by 10. It has a gross vehicle weight rating of 7,000 pounds. It has two 3,500 pound axles. If you'd like to see more about the details of the dump trailer, be sure to check out the review video that I did. You'll also notice that I am towing this trailer with a 2020 Toyota Tundra Crew Max Limited 4x4. I can't say enough how pleased I am with the Tundra. It's a great vehicle for towing. All Tundras are geared with a 4.3 gear ratio in the rear end, so they are set up for towing. And this, is, this truck has been great for me. So as you can see right now, we're just waiting for the first bucket. Um, you'll notice that I am parked on the scale. This gentleman told me that I had to have the wheels of the trailer on the scale as well as the rear wheels of the truck on the scale. Uh, he's an excellent operator as you'll see. He actually is able to guesstimate because this is not an electronic scale. Uh, it's old fashioned. So he told me that it would take just over two buckets. Uh, so if you notice here, uh, we're going to be getting the first bucket at this point, uh, and then he'll go back for the subsequent buckets. Now you'll also notice that this particular river rock is a bit dusty. Um, there's just a lot of dust and dirt along with it, but I'm not worried about that because once the rain hits, it's going to wash all that dust away, and I'm sure it will be great. When we went to the yard to look at the different options for river rock, this was what my wife chose. So that's why we're getting this particular uh, color. This is essentially a sand color, uh, which is fine for me because that's going to look great with the landscaping, especially with it being a neutral color. I was quite surprised that one scoop on the payloader didn't seem to be very much once it was dumped into the trailer. Uh, I know that a 5x10 dump is the smaller size of dump trailer, but I guess what I'm getting at is I can definitely understand how a dump trailer like this could easily be overloaded because once you see what two ton of rock looks like in this trailer and how much space there is left it would be very easy to overload it so i do want to take a moment and talk about the toyota tundra first of all the toyota tundra does have a tow haul button and i do notice a performance difference when using the tow haul button it seems as though the transmission definitely shifts differently. It also seems as though the engine helps to hold you back so you're not relying completely on the brakes. And I should also mention that a slight touch of the accelerator seems to get more RPMs out of the engine than when the tow haul button is not pressed. So I am very pleased with the Tundra. This is actually my third Tundra and all of them have been super reliable. Now I only have 6,000 miles on the truck at this point in time, but I'm expecting the same reliability as I've had out of the previous ones I've owned. Okay, so as you can see, there is two scoops from the payloader. That's just under two ton. So he's gonna come back and just put a little bit more on there to make the two ton amount. I will tell you that this gentleman is very experienced with the loader. He is able to estimate the amount he needs and then it turns out when we went inside to actually get a weight reading that it was exactly two tons. So that is definitely a professional here. You can tell he's done this many, many, many times. And it's amazing to me even the fact of how little he has in the bucket this time that he's able to estimate that. So hats off to him for doing a great job with loading. Uh, and as you can see, this isn't even filling up the trailer as much as you might think. Uh, the payload on this particular trailer is roughly 2.3 tons. So I just got two tons in this case, so I could fit a little bit more rock. But once again, I don't want to overload it. I want to make sure that I'm within the towing capacity of the truck as well as the weight capacity of the trailer. 
Okay, so now we are back at my house and I'm going to go ahead and dump this load of river rock. I do want to mention that the newer Lamar mini dumps can be configured with a spreader gate that does a combination spreader slash barn door style. Uh, in this case, I just have the barn doors. Always make sure that you have the doors hooked back before you dump because you will bend the doors and that can be quite uh, an annoyance, let alone a hassle to get corrected. So here you can see the river rock is coming out without a problem. Uh, I also want to mention that I didn't use the tarp this time because I didn't feel it was necessary. I literally am just right down the road from the supply yard. Okay, so as you can see, this trailer is not having any problems dumping the two ton. Okay, so there you have it. The Lamar mini dump in action. Be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel.